friends welcome to the channel beauty Air academy this video is the continuation of the msc nursing 2018 entrance exam question paper and this is the part 6 of the question paper discussion so here the first question is some diuretics cause excessive amount of electrolytes to be excreted which electrolyte is most often associated with diuretics options are sodium potassium chloride bicarbonate the correct answer here is option b potassium option b potassium is the correct answer next question the client has an order for two tablespoon of milk of magnesia the nurse converting this to the metric system would give the client options 10 ml 15 ml 30 ml 20 ml the correct answer here is option c 30 ml answer is option c 30 ml next question name of the test used to test the patency of radial artery options blanche test allen's test babinski test grind test correct answer here is option b allen's test option b is the answer allen's test the client's abg result shows ph 7.32 PaCO2 58, HCO3 32. The client is experiencing which acid base imbalance? Options are respiratory alkalosis, metabolic acidosis, respiratory acidosis, metabolic alkalosis. The correct answer is respiratory acidosis. Option C, respiratory acidosis is the answer. Then the next question. A client requiring the highest possible concentration of oxygen therapy in short time will need which of the following delivery system? Options are mask with reservoir bag, face tent, venturi mask, nasal cannula. A client requiring the highest possible concentration of oxygen therapy in short time will need which one of the following delivery system? So here the answer is mask with reservoir bag option a is the answer mask with reservoir bag which one of the following is an example of intentional tort options false imprisonment breach of duty negligence malpractice which one of the following is an example of intentional tort options are false imprisonment breach of duty negligence malpractice correct answer is option a false imprisonment false imprisonment is an example of intentional tort the nurse is unable to locate the client's popliteal pulse during a routine examination the next step is to options check for a femoral pulse check for a pedal pulse take the blood pressure on that thigh check for carotid pulse if the nurse is unable to locate the client's popliteal pulse during the routine examination the next step is to check for a pedal pulse correct answer is option b check for a pedal pulse the needle stick safety and prevention act was passed in the year options december 1998 november 2000 november 2002 april 2010 the needle stick safety and prevention act it was passed in the year november 2000 correct answer is option b number 2000 next question a nurse plans to administer a 3 ml intramuscular injection which muscle is least desirable to use for the administration of this medication a nurse plans to administer a 3 ml intramuscular injection which muscle is least desirable to use for the administration of this medication options are vastus lateralis deltoid ventrogluteal dorsogluteal so here the deltoid muscle is least desirable to use for administration of this medication so the answer option b is the right answer then the next question after cardiac arrest irreversible brain damage occurs within after cardiac arrest irreversible brain damage occurs within options 2 to 4 minutes 1 to 4 minutes 4 to 6 minutes 8 to 10 minutes correct answer is 4 to 6 minutes 4 to 6 minutes is the correct answer option c that is after cardiac arrest irreversible brain damage occurs within 4 to 6 minutes 
the nasal cannula delivers oxygen at a flow rate of options 2 to 6 liters per minute 4 to 6 liters per minute 5 to 6 liters per minute 7 to 8 liters per minute the nasal cannula delivers oxygen at a flow rate of here the answer is 2 to 6 liters per minute the nasal cannula delivers oxygen at the rate of 2 to 6 liters per minute option a is the answer the normal fat content present in the stool is options are 2 to 4 grams per 24 hours 9 to 10 grams per 24 hours 5 to 6 grams per 24 hours 7 to 8 grams per 24 hours the normal fat content present in stool is so here the answer is option a that is 2 to 4 gram per minute is the answer the normal fat content present in stool is 2 to 4 grams per 24 hours option a is the answer 2 to 4 grams per 24 hours then the next question when the body temperature alternates at regular intervals between the periods of fever and periods of normal and subnormal temperature the condition is termed as options are remittent fever intermittent fever relapsing fever crisis question is when the body temperature alternate at regular intervals between periods of fever and periods of normal and subnormal temperature so that condition is known as the intermittent fever that is known as the intermittent fever so option b is the answer intermittent fever means the temperature body temperature alternate at regular intervals with periods of fever and also normal temperature then the next question pain elicited on palpation of the right lower quadrant of the abdomen indicates pain elicited on palpation of right lower quadrant of the abdomen indicates options Cullen sign, Rossing sign, Allen sign, Turner sign. Options Cullen sign, Rossing sign, Allen sign, Turner sign. So the pain elicited on palpation of the right quadrant of abdomen is known as the Rossing sign. Option B is the answer. Then the next question. During percussion, an extremely dull sound produced by dense tissue is known as. During percussion, an extremely dull sound produced by dense tissue is known as. Options resonance dullness flatness tympani resonance dullness flatness and tympani the correct answer is option c is the answer flatness during percussion extremely dull sound that is produced by dense tissue is known as flatness so, option c is the answer thank you thank you for watching this video also like the channel and also subscribe the channel and give your comments in the comment box